Hey guys, what's up? Coach Jake, Ironclad Methods. Look, so we're talking about um, inside versus outside step, right? Traditional wrestling is, you know, inside step, down, heel, toe, knee, drop, step, boom, here, okay? Everybody's heel, toe, knee, drop, step, boom, and then they get just smashed all the time, okay? Uh, and they use this inside step, right? So if you're right-handed, you lead your right foot. Maybe if you're not right-handed, you're still leading your right foot. And we uh, use a left leg lead, okay? I, I think that you should be using a left leg lead. It's, a, it's an unorthodox stance for traditional wrestling, um, but it makes so, so much sense in so many ways. So we, we don't teach like right leg dominance only. We, we teach both legs leading, okay? Um, and we talk about an outside step, and there's a bunch of reasons why. I wanna kinda dissect that because until you understand why, you're not gonna really be willing to give up what you've been doing for so long, what's ingrained in you, especially coaches. That's a really hard thing to do, right? And so. Um, Typically speaking, when, so if I take this shot with inside step, okay, I'm driving on in here, whatever, boom, okay, I get to this position. Like, this is this is tough, right? Um, and so I, I have a bad angle. I want to start with that, that like, you know, as, as I go to drop in on my shot, this angle is disappearing, okay? You see this a lot in young wrestlers. When I go to hit my shot here, and he, the angle comes back, and I'm, he's almost, like, behind me before things get started, right? Like, th this is this is natural, okay? Because you're already not going to get to the leg, right? And he's naturally floating away, okay? And so you're shooting where he's not going to be, and, and this this right here happens, okay? Um, and traditionally, like, kids like to grab one leg because they know that it's easier to hold on to one than it is the two. So they've already, they're, they're already off, right? They're, if I went to both legs, I, I might be okay because I can change off. If this foot goes back, I can keep wrestling through into a single leg. But, but young wrestlers go here, inside step to one leg. I lose the angle, and now I'm screwed. I, I really can't recover from this position. I'm almost beat. In fact, guys are getting like really close to getting taken down. It's like, if they're good, they get back out of here and come back up. But now, because I was threatened, because I almost got scored on, all because I have a bad angle when I go inside step here and it disappears, he's so close to getting behind me that even if I get away, even if I don't give up the takedown here, I'm man enough to hold on to his leg or, or somehow I wrestle back out and, you know, real close to getting the takedown, but I don't. I'm, it's like negatively reinforcing taking shots because I know I almost got scored on. Now, I, I, I'm, I'm more like restrictive. I, I really don't want to go take shots because I think like if I take another one, he's probably going to score on me. And so, number one is that is that, that you know this creates a problem. So I don't like the inside step for that reason because already my angle is bad. If you're going to be stepping with your right foot, you should be on a single leg, I think, which is technically an outside step position. All right. So that's number one. Catch us in the next. We're going to get you guys on board with us later.